Hello and welcome to Clarify Review Hub. In today's episode, we're diving into the best podcast and ASMR microphones for 2024. But first, an exciting announcement. Once our channel hits 1,000 subscribers, we'll be giving away one of the fantastic products we've reviewed to our viewers. Remember, this giveaway is only open to viewers in America and Europe. Don't just subscribe, make sure you turn on notifications to not miss out on the big moments. Now let's explore the world of microphones that will elevate your sound. And now, we're diving into one of YouTube content creator's most loyal companions, the Blue Yeti microphone. First off, the Blue Yeti shines like a rock star among USB microphones. Why, you ask? Because of its plug-and-play feature, allowing you to connect to your computer and start recording in no time. One of the Yeti's most cherished features is its versatile polar pattern settings. Cardioid, bi-directional, omnidirectional, and stereo. This microphone adapts to any situation. Doing a live stream? Go cardioid. Conducting an interview? Bi-directional's your pick. Want to capture sound from all directions? Omnidirectional it is. Shooting an ASMR video? Stereo's the way. The Yeti is practically a Swiss army knife. When it comes to sound quality, the Yeti definitely ranks high among microphones in its price range. However, its high sensitivity can sometimes pick up unwanted background noises. This might make you feel like you're recording in a zoo rather than a quiet studio at home. But worry not. With the right settings, the Yeti can turn you into a sound engineering wizard. In conclusion, the Blue Yeti is an excellent starter microphone for YouTube content creators, podcasters, and ASMR artists. And now, up next, the apple of mobile content creators' eyes. The Shure MV88 Portable iOS Microphone. Plug it into your iPhone and become Steven Spielberg instantaneously. Well, if Spielberg was into sound recording, that is. At first glance, the MV88 might strike you as a character from Transformers. Compact, sleek, and sturdy, a studio you can carry around. This mic plugs directly into your iPhone's lightning port, eliminating the oh my god, I left my adapter at home panic among many other advantages. The Shure MV88 is perfect for vlogs, music recordings, ASMR videos, and even street interviews. It delivers high quality sound recordings and don't be fooled by its size. This little device captures sound with great finesse. Plus, it comes with the Shure Plus Motive audio recording app, so you can edit your recordings right on your phone. But, like every beautiful thing in our life, the MV88 has its limitations. First off, it's compatible with iOS devices only. Android users, sorry, but you're not invited to this party. And of course, with the lightning connection, charging your device at the same time can be a bit tricky. So don't forget to bring your power bank or your recording session might get cut short. In conclusion, if you're an iPhone owner looking to make high quality recordings on the go, the Shure MV88 won't disappoint you. And now, it's time to talk about the Marlin Brando of the microphone world, the Rode K2. Hearing vacuum tube might make you wonder, what year is this 1950? But don't be fooled, the Rode K2 marries modern technology with a vintage touch, elevating your sound recordings to something akin to a Hollywood film score. The Rode K2 is a favorite among professionals seeking studio quality recordings. Known for its warm and natural tones, it envelops your voice like a cup of coffee. And yes, it might be as pricey as a Starbucks coffee because the K2 is not a budget option. Thanks to its vacuum tube design, the Rode K2 captures and reproduces sound incredibly. It records every nuance of your voice, even the pleading tone when you say, if you liked this video, please subscribe, in the most natural way. However, remember, Vacuum tube technology means this microphone requires a bit of maintenance. Another advantage of the Rode K2 is its versatility. It offers changeable polar patterns to adapt to various recording scenarios. Whether you're recording a solo podcast or an orchestra, the K2 has got you covered. However, its size and the power source it requires mean it's not ideal for mobile recordings. In conclusion, the Rode K2 is an excellent choice for anyone serious about sound recording and seeking warm, natural, and professional sound quality in their studios. And lastly, we've arrived at the hidden champion of budget-friendly microphones, the MXL 990. This microphone makes you wonder, can it really be this good for the price? 
The MXL 990D is known for its clean and clear sound, making it ideal for podcasts, ASMR videos, and vocal recordings. But if you're asking, can I record a rock concert with this mic? The answer is probably, that might be a bit challenging. The MXL 990 is designed more for controlled studio environments. One of the biggest advantages of this microphone, aside from its price, is how user-friendly it is. It's easy to set up and doesn't require expensive additional equipment, a huge relief for those new to the world of microphones. Another point to note is that the MXL 990 can be overly sensitive for some users. So, if even the sound of your breathing or the ticking of a clock in the room is a concern during recording, this mic might make you sweat a bit. In conclusion, the MXL 990A is an excellent budget-friendly option. Sure, dreaming of recording at Abbey Road Studios with this mic might be a stretch, but if you're looking to start your own YouTube channel or dive into the world of podcasting, the MXL 990 is a perfect starting point. We've reached the end of our guide on the best podcast and ASMR microphones for 2024. We hope the information and advice we've provided will be helpful in your projects. If you found our content useful, please remember to like and subscribe for more. Join the conversation in the comments. We'd love to hear your thoughts. Until our next video, take care.